Hi everyone, this is Mahmoud Sheikh and in today's video I will discuss about const qualifier. Okay, so here I have listed up some points. Let us discuss these points one by one. Okay, now the first point says the keyword const stands for constant and it says that the value of constant will not be changed throughout the program. Okay, so we declare variables throughout our program. We can create a normal variable and we can create constant variable. So the difference between normal variable and a variable which has been declared as a const or constant variable that the value of a variable will be keep on changing throughout the execution of the program. But the value of the const variable, the value of a variable which we have declared as const, it cannot be changed. Okay, so the once you have initialized any value to that constant variable throughout that program, the value of that variable has to be only that value. Okay, so it's not possible for you to make changes to the value of the variable which you have declared as const variable. So now the next point is if an attempt is made to change the value of variable declared with const qualifier, compiler will throw an error message saying that cannot modify a constant object. Okay, So even if you try to change the value of a variable which you have declared as a const variable, then compiler will throw you an error message saying that you cannot modify the const object. We will see that with the help of an example. Okay, So now here there is a syntax of const identifier. Okay? So it has to start with the const keyword and then this data data type okay and then followed by the name of the variable as you can see here there is an example okay, const keyword followed by a data type float and a variable name pi and i have assigned it the value of 3.142 okay so it's always a good practice to write all the variables which you have declared as a const qualifier in uppercase letters so that you can make a distinction between your normal variables and the const variable so i hope you understood what is const qualifier here const stands for constant which means whichever variable you have declared as const in your program the value of that const qualifier will not be changed throughout the program Okay, so now let us see an example. So here you can see I have written a program to calculate the area of a circle. As you can see here, I have declared two variables of type float and one variable again of type float, but that variable I have declared as a const qualifier. Okay, and then I am asking the user to enter the value for the radius and then the user will be entering the value for the radius and then I am storing that value and here as you can see already I have initialized some value to this variable pi const variable but below this you can see I'm trying to make some changes to this value okay and then I'm calculating the area and then I'm printing it so now this program will throw you an error so now let me just show you that okay here as you can see I have written that program the same program I have written in this editor okay turbo compiler so now if I try to run this program as you can see it's giving me an error saying cannot modify a const object okay so here you can see I have already assigned a value as 3.142 and if I again want to make a changes to the value of this const qualifier then compiler will not allow me to do that okay so now let's comment it out and run it once again okay now you can see i will enter the value of radius as 3.2 now you will see it will display you a uh, messages 32.17 area of a circle okay so now this is everything about uh, const qualifier okay as you can see here this pi variable is been declared as a const that's why throughout this program we cannot make changes to the value of this const 
qualifier okay so this is what, this was everything about const qualifier so i hope you understood the concept of const qualifier and uh, that's all for this video guys if you like this video click on like button share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching